Jane, I think you want to see this. Jane believes in things that a lot of her colleagues might find nutty. She is a scientist, someone who watches the heavens and tries to understand the way in which interdimensional travel is possible. Obviously, Thor's arrival confirms a lot of the things she believes in. Please, open your eyes. Where did he come from? At first, Jane, I think, thinks of him as a study subject. How'd you get inside that cloud? Also, how could you eat an entire box of Pop-Tarts and still be this hungry? The Thor and Jane stuff was fantastic. One of the, their, their biggest concerns was making that relationship work. But who are you, really? You'll see soon enough. God, I hope you're not crazy. <laughs> Slowly, obviously, she starts to relate to him and fall in love with him. I must go back to Asgard, but I give you my word. I will return for you. Jane Foster will play an enormously important part in this film. She's going to have to help him because she has scientific information that allows for a Thor without powers to work out maybe how he gets back home. And this is where we say goodbye.